Shahijit Gill. Can the consciousness exist without our brain? Are we just biological beings made up of matter or is there anything more that constitutes us? Or in more simplified words, is there any such thing as metaphysical or supernatural? Shahijit, the consciousness definitely exists without a brain and this is something which uh, these great neurologists and neuroanatomists are yet to understand because they think that consciousness is made of matter or consciousness can be understood by mapping the brain, by getting the images of the brain, by doing the EEGs of the brain. Well, the consciousness uh, uses the brain as the seat, but as such the consciousness is spread out not only within the body, but also outside the body. It is the, the limitations which we have brought upon ourselves that we restrict our being, we restrict our consciousness in the body alone, but the consciousness as such is limitless, is beyond the brain, is beyond the body, is beyond the perception of the human researches which they wish to do it in uh, their uh, laboratories or through the man-made machines. Consciousness is not man-made and consciousness is not just uh, something to do with the matter. And regarding your question of metaphysical and supernatural, I don't know what you mean by that. When you say supernatural, most of the time people think like the Bhut Pret Devta are the supernatural. And when you say metaphysical, then uh, metaphysical can be also addressed to the subtleties of uh, your being. Even mind is uh, metaphysical. Even your uh, thinking is metaphysical. You as such is neither physical nor metaphysical and your consciousness may be of a very lower grade but deep down within you the supra consciousness is already existent which you don't have to uh, gain out, but the only thing is you just need to explore it, how it is there functioning within you.